needed this. in the gate. I know. Let him in. So, a uh, couple months ago, we were up by Crazy Willie's just scavenging, you know. You got what you need? Yeah, everything I could think of. Let's go. Well, you sound pretty excited. It's the candle, Deke. What? The old saying, it's better to light one candle than curse the darkness. We've spent the last two years doing a whole lot of cursing. We get the lights on at last leg, and that's lighting our first candle. Yeah, only one problem with that. And what's that, Deke? Lights attract all kinds of nasty bugs, and they make it way easier for him to find you. Hey, we're here! Shit! It's warmers. I was hoping it was gonna be clear. Nah, why would we have that kind of luck? There we go. <sighs> okay, I think that's all of them. Okay, to fix this thing, I gotta climb up there. <laughs> Have you done this before? Nope, but there's a first time for everything, right? Right. Okay, come on, boost me up. All right, ready? Uh-huh. One, two, three! If you fall, it ain't like I can catch you. Hey, oh. I'll try to keep that in mind. I got him! Try him! God damn it. Oh. Well, that was fun. Yeah, we're gonna have to come out and do this again sometime. Yeah, I'll talk to Schizo about getting some barbed wire around this. It'll keep the newts off. Yeah, sounds like the kind of shit job he likes to give me. <laughs> You'll live. Come on, I gotta check something else out. Deke, how you lost her at that refugee camp. But 
the one north of Belknap. And in the last few weeks, we've seen Nero choppers in the air, and you were hoping for what? A miracle? That she was with them somehow? Something like that. But she's not. No. I'm sorry. Look, it's not a big deal, so let's just drop it. Okay. Wow, word gets around. I'm almost ready. Power to the whole resort is routed through here. I pulled the breaker a week ago so it wouldn't short out. Okay, ready when you are. All right, let's listen up. Okay, now the past few months have been tough. Not gonna deny that. We're low on food, medicine, hell. Pretty much everything. But we got one thing in spades. And without that, everything else is meaningless. That one thing is trust. Now, a while ago, we had some more drifters right into camp. Some of you said kick them out. We ain't got enough for ourselves. Some of you said we can't trust them. Tonight is proof of what I've been saying all along. We need everyone. I mean everyone who is willing to be here, who is willing to work, who is willing to help us rebuild. Now for the past couple of months, Ricky has been doing just that. She can't do it alone. She needs help. Tonight is going to happen because we welcomed a drifter into our camp. And we allowed him to earn our trust. Tonight, we take one more step out of the darkness. So the woman in the photo, that was her? That was my wife, yeah. Dumb question. I'm I'm sorry, Dick. No, don't be. She's uh she's been dead a long time. Still, it can't be easy to get your hopes up like that, only to I, I don't know. I wish there was something I could do. Well, there is. What? Stop talking about it. Okay. Addie? Addie! The lights are up. I don't think she's here. Addie, you here? Okay, well, strip. Strip, strip what? Take your shirt off, sit on the table. Hey, look, it's nothing. Deacon, do you want an infection? Mm hmm. I may be an engineer, Deke, but that does not mean. Aha. Uh -huh. That I don't know how to treat a cut. Yeah, I never would have guessed the way that you were caressing those switches and circuits or whatever the hell <laughs> you were doing. All right, this <clears throat> might hurt just a little bit. Ready? 
<laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay. Really? No, I want to just wait for Addie to come back, just, huh? Shh. Hang on. There. It's done. Big baby. So I told you it was nothing. <laughs> yeah, you did. <clears throat> Oh, wow. You really have been at war. Yeah, more than one. Shit, that's right. Where was this one? Afghanistan or the MC or after? I, uh, I don't remember. What about this one? Ricky, uh, I'm not sure that, uh, I heard that Addie doesn't really like um, people messing around in her business. Yeah, I, I heard that too. What about this one? <sighs> Dick, I'm not married. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Why don't you come back tomorrow? And see Addie, and she's gonna tell you how great of a job I did. Ricky, um... <sighs> Deke, it's, it's... it's fine. You're welcome. Hey, Deacon? <clears throat> Maybe one day, stop and light a candle. It can get pretty dark and cold out there. Addie. Hey, Deacon, how can I help you? Uh, it's Boozer. Is he okay? He's, yeah, not well. He's not. He's not sick or anything. It's just, I don't know. Well, I told you that it was going to be a big adjustment. Do you have any drugs around here? Like antidepressants, something like that? No. Sorry. Okay. Wait. I heard about what happened. How we went after those guys who were killing those dogs. Yeah, and he nearly got us killed while doing it. Well, maybe that's your answer. Nearly getting us killed while doing it? Look, what does William love so much that he'd be willing to risk his own life? He doesn't need something to heal his body. He needs something to heal his soul. I got it. Thanks, Eddie. A couple of guys burned out a nest a few weeks back. Deke, no, how's nest. my favorite bounty hunter? Hey, Blair, how are things in the gun? Hey, hey, heard a rumor that you're looking for those black choppers. Nero. Is that true? I think I saw one the other night. Yeah, well, you heard wrong. I don't, I don't give a damn about Nero or their choppers or anything else. Well, sorry, man. Uh, why so testy about it? I mean, yeah, I'll see you, Deke. Deke, long time no see. Oh my god, Deacon, I heard you were the one who got the lights back on. Oh, thank you so much. 
Yeah, well, you heard wrong. It was all Ricky. She's the one that you need to thank. Ricky? <laughs> I could kiss her. Just don't tell Bree. Uh, good choice. Good one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Don't be such a stranger. Hey, Deacon, you there? Yeah, Hattie. Check this out. One of my patients overheard us. They might know where you can find a healthy dog. Okay, I'm listening. There's a small resort south of Sherman's camp. Uh, a bunch of cabins in the woods. You know the one I mean? No. Okay, it's off Santium Highway. The same road you take to the old sawmill. I, and Ricky said she rode with you over there to see the horde? Yeah. That day you guys were gone all day. To the dam. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, I know what, I know what you mean. Alki, do you read me? Alki, come in. Damn it. Someone go out and find him. Check the dig site. How's it going, Tucker? Oh, <laughs> 
I gotta burn them out. I gotta make it safer to ride. There's another nest. Yeah, let's burn it up. Later, burn out these nests. Finish burning out these nests. I'm in bed. I guess we all have that coming. Oh, I smell a nest. Gotta be right here. inside that mobile medical unit. Should be clear now. Damn freakerness. Should be safer not to be here now.
God damn it. Fuse blown. <laughs> Gotta take a closer look. the generator. Okay, let's take a look around. Where the hell am I gonna get a fuse? <laughs> Feels, yes. Out of gas, of course. Yes, narrow it. 
projector. Just gonna close my eyes for a bit. 